For those of you I haven't met or talked at, because I feel like a lot of you were at the launch party, I'm Zara, I'm chair of the James Walk Board. Um, and I'm here to talk about like our really, really, really exciting new initiative, uh, the Action Grant. So I don't know how much has been, has nothing. Oh my God, I'm announcing our Action Grant. This is amazing. Um, so I'd like to announce the Action Grant. So, um, for so many years uh, at, at Jane's Walk, we've been talking about like the things we talk about, and I imagine the things that you talk about as participants and walk leaders are the amazing connections that happen like a week later, or two weeks later, or you run into someone on the street who's a Jane's Walker and the community that's built. Um, but the other thing that's really amazing about Jane's Walk is that things actually happen out of the Jane's Walk, and we don't measure it that much um, as an organization, because for us, the most important thing is the walk. But we're starting to notice that these are the kinds of things, th the kinds of things coming out of Jane's Walk are the kinds of things we want to start supporting and seeding um, to see if they have the potential to grow. Um, so tonight we're announcing the Jane's Walk, I think we're calling them the Eyes on the Street uh, Micro Action Grants. Oh, there's something, oh, a few people here, they're like, oh. <laughs> um, I'm going to look up there, too. Um, so we're announcing a, a set of micro-grants. We're going to be giving out two grants at $1,000 each uh, and two grants at $500 each. And these grants are for anyone, any collective, any organization who participated in or led a Jane's Walk this year. So the idea had to emerge from the walk itself. But it can be anything. And for us, we just want to see if maybe a little, a little bit more runway beyond the walk can actually see some really great change in communities. Um, so we really want all of you to apply. Um, there is all the details. I saw there's a stack of these somewhere in the back um, that have all the boring details that I won't get into now. But this is a really um, exciting moment for us. And it's, and it's done, actually, with the support of Evergreen City Works. And Maya is here from Evergreen City Works. Um, and so the reason we can do it is because they generously donated um, the funds to make this happen. So if you see a City Works person in the next few months, just give them a nice pat on the back and say thanks <laughs> on behalf of Jane's Walk. Uh, but we really hope that you all apply. You have about, I think, about a month and a half to think through what your ideas are. Um, and just, you know, anything. And, and I think we are really excited about how open this can be. Um, it's not so often that you can actually give away money that has a little bit of agility and a little bit of flexibility. So please just, if you think it's a good idea, please just write it down and send it our way because we really want to see a diversity of ideas. And the ones that get funded, are, I mean, I feel like this is a cheap thing to say, but like, the ones that get funded aren't the only great ideas, right? Like, so, so we also want to see what those ideas are that are coming out of the walk. So for us, it's a way to actually harvest some of that intelligence and storytelling um, to understand what's next and also to look forward to year 10, which I know that we're all really excited about, and I imagine you, the people who you know make Jane's Walk breathe, are even more excited about. So, um, so I'm going to I'm going to point you to Denise to grab those. Please, please apply. If you have any questions, you probably shouldn't ask me. You should probably ask them because I'll just tell you fake things. Um, <laughs> but ask ask one of the amazing members of the Jane's Walk team, and, and good luck. We're really excited. <laughs>